Hey everybody, Steve here in the New York store. I want to talk to you a little bit about uh, a Craviato kit, but more importantly today we're going to talk a little bit about uh, different choices for rims on drums, <clears throat> and uh, specifically on toms in this case. Uh, we've got options with Craviato that include the standard triple flanged rim, which is a light rim with a flange at the top, and that's a, uh, a good rim, but it's a lighter weight rim, so they generally produce more overtones uh, in the drum. Now, you can go to the other end of the scale and get a very heavy die cast rim like you find on Gretsch drums. A heavy die cast rim is going to take a lot of the overtones out, and in fact, I think personally too many of the overtones for uh, a kit like a Craviato, where you want to have a nice amount of resonance for those beautiful solid shells. In between, there are some different options that you can choose. <clears throat> One of them is a double flanged rim that's a little bit like a stick chopper of the old days, uh, made of steel. That's an option. But another option is what we're looking at right here, and this is a particularly unique option because these are very, very cool rims. These rims are solid brass rims, and they are handmade by Adrian Kirschler over in Italy. Um, Adrian is a phenomenal, phenomenal master craftsman who makes the uh, uh, metal shell drums that we, uh, we offer periodically as the uh, Craviato AK Masters model snare drums. But Adrian also makes uh, his own drums, and he also makes these rims. And these rims are remarkably good. They are uh, very much like, like an old single flanged rim as you look at it. But the difference here is instead of using a claw hook, an old rim would use a claw hook that would stick up on top of the rim, an old single flange. He has built in a little node here into the rim. And by doing that, it eliminates the need for the claw, which is fabulous. So what's the value of these rims? If you think about it in terms of sound, brass rims are always going to give you a little added brightness to the sound because of the material. And these are not terribly heavy. They're probably somewhere in between uh, the weight of a triple flange and the weight of a die cast. So what you're going to do is you're going to take some of the overtones out here, which is nice. It makes it a little bit easier to dial them into a pure tone. But it's also going to give you plenty of resonance. And they're very, very musical sounding uh, drums to begin with. So with hoops like this, it even adds to it. So we're going to give you a little sound <coughs> sample here, and I'll talk through it a little bit as we go and do some different things. And then I'm also going to talk a little bit about this kit. This is a Craviato kit that we have in the shop that is uh, the Jazzette sizes with an 8x12, a 14x14, a 12x18 bass drum. And these are solid mahogany with 30 degree bearing edges. It is a phenomenally good kit. The snare that's with it is a favorite of mine. It's a maple uh, mahogany hybrid here, stacked solid as we call it, 6.5 by 14, that uh, I really, really love. This is just an incredible, incredible snare. It's maple, mahogany, maple, as you see here. It just sounds fabulous. This is just triple flange rims on the snare right now, but I want to go through and give you a sense for <coughs> what these solid brass hoops from Adrian Kirschler sound like. So we'll give you a little, uh, little idea of uh, musicality on this kit. musical, beautiful sound. So now we'll give you an idea of this whole entire kit together, which is fabulous. The kit's for sale on the website, of course, maxwelldrums.com. So we'll give you a sample of that.
beautiful, beautiful sounding drums. And again, these solid brass hoops, <clears throat> they're fabulous. They're just incredible. They are uh, not inexpensive, but if you really like that sound and you're looking for something unique and different, this can be a really good solution for you on any kit, but especially on a beautiful solid shell kit like this Craviato. You can see us on the web, of course, maxwelldrums.com. You can see this kit there. You can see this snare drum there and a bunch of other things. Thanks.